a 20-year-old student of Bristol University, identified as a Majola Ogun Dock, reportedly took her own life in a Cardiff hotel room. Staff at the Citrus Hotel in Cardiff found her body hanging in her hotel room after she missed her checkout deadline, The Sun UK reports. She had allegedly booked the room three weeks earlier. We gathered that the late Majola, described as bright and bubbly, was in the second year of an economics undergraduate degree at Bristol University and was a leading member of the Gospel Choir Society. A student found hanged in a hotel room is the 11th suspected suicide from the same university in two years. An inquest was later held into her death at Pontypridd Coroner's Court. Her family said she was her usual bubbly self when she visited home in Hounslow, West London, three days before her death. In a statement read out to the court, her father Curl Ogundak said he last saw his daughter when she returned home for mothering Sunday days before he received news of her death. Ogundak said, I last saw a Majola on March 11th when she returned home for the weekend. She appeared her usual bubbly self. Ogundak said his daughter returned to Bristol on the same day. He later received a WhatsApp message from her to say she had returned home to her student flat in the city. Police informed him of his daughter's death three days later. He said the family were not aware of any ill health and did not think she suffered from depression or mental health problems. He added, We are absolutely devastated about the loss of my daughter. We are still trying to process what has happened. But a close friend of a Majola, Hannah Agbegbi, told the court that a Majola had disclosed she was depressed and having suicidal thoughts. In a written statement read out to the court, M's Hannah said, She, a Majola, was an independent person. She didn't really talk a lot about her personal life. It was around this time, when she moved to Bristol, that she disclosed to me that she was depressed and she had been having suicidal thoughts. After thorough investigations presented by the police, coroner Christopher Woolley accepted the cause of death given by consultant pathologist Dr. David Thomas at the University Hospital of Wales as death by hanging. Woolley said, I am satisfied that the officer has followed up all the possible leads she could have done, examined all the records, and from that she has managed to piece together some detail of the last few days of a Majola's life. I am satisfied from the thorough police investigation that there were no third parties. There is no evidence that she was cajoled by any third party. There's no evidence that she met anyone and there is no evidence that anyone entered her room.